My boyfriend doesn't know I will break up with him after his residency exam. Posted by Deleted. We have been together three years. Only in the last year his alcoholism started to show. He is a mean drunk so every time after he goes out to drink, he arrives home only to scream at me. He also got into non-legal substances, so the arriving home is around 10 a.m. after not hearing from him for half a day. The shouting finally became name-calling. After giving him an ultimatum about his lifestyle choices and how they affect me, I was promised everything will change. No more nights turned into mornings, turned into evenings. No more leaving me to go home alone. No more shouting. No more non-legal substances. No more secrets as where he is or with whom. But he doesn't know I know he lied every weekend when he told me he is in bed sleeping. He doesn't know I know every girl he gave his insta to, that I know he begged his friends to lie to me. He doesn't know that as soon as he comes home after his residency exam I will have my stuff packed and ready to leave. One week from today. He doesn't know that while he is talking about us buying a house together and getting married I cry because of how stupid he was, not because I am happy. He is currently singing in the other room, making plans for how we'll celebrate if he passed the exam. And now to the update. I did break up with him. Thank you all for liking and commenting, I did read each and every comment of yours and it was a relief going through this week. A few clarifications that may have sparked confusion. I'm not from the US, English is not my first language, so when I googled residency exam, it seemed like what I was referring to. The exam a med student takes to start working in a hospital. So referring to those that told me to tell his boss, he doesn't have one. To those who told me to report to the board there isn't a board. He took several admission tests that verify him apt psychologically and physically. He passed all those tests. I cannot go against several doctors' approval with just my word. I went to the hospital and asked what I have to do to prove he's a danger. They told me that I would need hard proof that I cannot get, but he hospital reassured me there are checkup saints and they will keep an eye on him. I also told his parents and his friends the real reason we broke up. Now the breakup. It did not go violently. I did what was suggested and I met him in a public place after his exam. At first he acted very weird, got up and left just to quickly came back saying he is sorry, but he does not want to feel this pain. We had a very civil talk where I told him how alone he made me feel every time we would go out and come back only at 12 am. I told him that he is not the person I would want to raise my children with. I told him how volatile he is, and how, even though he never hurt anybody, I don't want to be the first one. His reaction was to cry and beg telling me I am the love of his life and he will get help. He pledged me he will never meet up with those friends again, that he never cheated on me, that he will go to therapy. It was a long breakup. Since then he bought me tickets to Venice for my work milestone, which is in two months saying that it is for me, and if I want, maybe for us. He brought me flowers for Valentine's and asked if we could meet, I said no, and I said I will block him if he goes on like this. I am incredibly sad because my family won't talk to me, saying I am selfish for not helping them with their emotional needs even now, and saying I should take him back. I feel so sorry for the both of us, what non-legal substances and alcohol can turn you into. What do you think of all of this? Let me know of your thoughts in the comments below. It's heartbreaking to see how obsession can destroy relationships and families. Subscribe for more cute cats and daily Reddit stories.